I'm John Magnuson with the Cedar Tree Institute, and we're here to launch Earth Keepers 2, an interfaith environmental initiative in the coming two years with a focus on energy conservation and community gardens and bring back the native plants. Community church gardens. I have faith in seeds. Very good things will come from this. Delta Green is the technical partner. This is building on the work that our collaborative communities participated in from 2004 to 2009. And thanks to the United States Forest Service and the United States Environmental Protection Agency, at the heart of this work is a group of students from Northern Michigan University. My name is Tom Merkel. My name is Caitlin Bingner. I'm Adam Magnuson. But we will be working with tribes, especially Keweenaw Bay, and I want to honor them. Expect great wonders. Up next, we have Kira Fillmore, who is our project coordinator. Hi. Uh, another component of our grant is um, a, a vision that we've had for a while, and we're very excited to have it finally be able to come to fruition, and that is community church gardens, whether it be a vegetable garden, a healing garden, a meditation garden, herb garden, um, native plant garden. We're hoping that the gardens can bring people closer to God's creation by working in the earth, um, as well as closer to each other. And to help us with that uh, is our partner with the U.S. Forest Service, the Eastern Region Chief Botanist, Jan Schultz. I know that very good things will come from this. That is community church gardens, whether it be a vegetable garden, a healing garden, a meditation garden, herb garden. My native plant garden in Milwaukee is about 20 feet by 15 feet. And it is just a delight for me to see my workers in there. In the morning and coming back in the evening, the male bombus or bumblebees roost. My garden serves as a repository for those native bees and other pollinators for my whole urban community. These small native gardens serve as the pollinator source for the vegetable garden, not just in that churchyard, but in the neighborhood. And that is really a delightful thing. Those church lots and other uh, facilities related to that really do matter, and what we are doing really does matter. 